Well, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Greg McCloskey from ForexLive.com. I'm going to do a technical report on Bitcoin. I'm just going to focus on the daily chart and the technicals that are in play off of that chart at the moment. So sit right there and let's uh, learn. If I were to put a bias tilt on the uh, price of Bitcoin, I'm going to focus on what happened in trading here today so far. Um, actually, and yesterday. What we saw yesterday was that the price came down to the blue line right here. That blue line represents the 100-day moving average, and the price uh, found support buyers against that level. And trading here today, uh, what did the price do? It fell below that 100-day moving average, and we moved down to uh, a low price right near the 38.2% retracement at $26,655. Uh, the low price uh, in trading here today reached a level of $26,625, only about 30 30 pips short of or below that 38.2% retracement. So sellers had their opportunity to sell below the 100-day moving average after breaking below it and also getting below the 38.2% retracement at $26,655. They couldn't do it. So that tells to me, it tells me that uh, they had their shot, the sellers had their shot, they failed, the buyers are more in control. Now that control lasts only as long as the price can remain above those two technical levels. If we can remain above the 100-day moving average of 26,885, bias remains to the upside. If we can remain above the 38.2% retracement at 26,655, uh, the bias might be a little more bearish below the 100-day moving average, but the bias still is in favor of the buyers above that level. So in between these two levels is is our risk defining level for Bitcoin. If you know that, if you know that's your risk, then if the price does not risk you out, that is if you don't go below the 26,655 level, then you're still in the trade. And you what you hope for is the price to continue its uh, rotation back to the upside. On the top side, uh, this uh, trend line cuts across uh, with the uh, Two points along that trend line in trading. Uh, a few days ago, the price uh, moved up toward that uh, trend line and found early sellers. Uh, we're looking looking toward that uh, trend line for ideas uh, or a, a potential uh, a target level. In order, if we break above that level, that would be more more bullish uh, for the uh, price of Bitcoin. But really, the focus on this uh, trade idea is stay above the 100-day moving average, stay above the 38.2 percent retracement. If you could do that. Guess what? The buyers remain more in control. If you can't do that, then look to reverse, go short, and we might look to uh, uh, then we look toward our low prices uh, here and here uh, along this line right here, where the uh, price bottoms uh, came in right near each other around around uh, this uh, level around the uh, twenty five eight hundred level. Uh, that's above the fifty percent retracement of twenty five thousand. Three hundred and two dollars. Those would be the targets on the downside on further selling. So there you have a look at the uh, price of Bitcoin, the bias, the risk defining levels, and some targets and uh, 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 reversal uh, targets as well. My name is Greg McCloskey. Good fortune with your trading. Bye bye now.